after the greatest challenge faced by the country, China is now back to work. They are now back on track with their amazing automation and robotic system in their workplace. Watch! What's up everyone? Once again, this is Richard Aguilar and I'm back again with another amazing video for you. So, before we get started, don't forget to subscribe and smash the bell icon so that you don't miss any of our great videos. China now resumes work and production in the country. They are now back to business as usual. Watch! Number 1 is Anhui, Shenzhen, China resumes production. In East China's Anhui province, more than 251 major projects resume operation. So far, 90% of the major industrial companies with annual revenue of more than about 2.93 million US dollars have resumed operation. In Manchin city of Anhui, an industrial city with abundant mineral resources, 41 major projects have resumed operation including power generating project with a total investment of 11.2 billion yuan, about 1.6 billion US dollars. Number two is enterprises across China gradually resume operation. Caught off guard by unprecedented difficulties. Most enterprises in China have rolled out active precaution measures while resuming production. Because of the recent challenge they face, they are now much more prepared than before. Number 3 is Volkswagen Transmission Maker resumes production. Much to relief of its German managers, a Volkswagen transmission maker in China has resumed operation in an orderly and safe manner. Upon resuming their work, safety and preventive measures are strongly implemented to assure the welfare of their employees at work.
Number 4 is China's airports and railway services are now ready to resume work. Airports in central China's Hebei province, which was the worst hit province during the pandemic in China, are ready to reopen due to effective control and preventive measures. Among the airports are the Yichang Sanxia Airport, the Xiangyang Luigi Airport, the Shenongjia Haping Airport, and the Enqi Xujiaping Airport. Number 5 is, over 3,000 power grid projects fully resume work across China. More than 3,000 power grid projects across the country except Hebei province had resumed work after the crisis according to the latest data released by the State Grid Corporation of China. The operative projects so far include a total of 3,205 power transmission and transformation projects and 33 pump storage power projects under construction in China outside of Hebei. Number 6 is, construction sites across China resume work. People across China are heading back to work. The Ministry of Housing and Urban Rural Development said that 58% of housing and infrastructure building projects nationwide have resumed work. That's over 110,000 projects, including a water diversion project in central Yunnan province involving the return of over 5,000 works, and a cross-sea bridge connecting Shenzhen and Jiangshan in southern Guangdong province with 10,000 workers. Number 7 is Major Chinese construction projects resumed work. Construction work for many of the country's major projects has been resuming in an orderly fashion. Just like what you can see in here, this is just one example of many construction works in China that are resuming works. Number 8 is, work resumes gradually in Wuhan.
since China is now back to work, you can see here that vehicles are now queuing up on the highway to enter Wuhan. As many firms in China are gradually getting back on business, many of China's citizens are now becoming busy for work and business as usual. And that's all there is to it for today's video. So if you found this video wonderful, please give us a like, subscribe, and share this with others. Once again, this is Richard Aguilar. Thanks for watching and see you on my next video.